If you really want to know what's going on in the market here in Fort Myers area, listen, this video is for you because there's so many people talk about this happening and this happening and there is a lack of inventory. There's too many inventory, right? There's so many different videos, so many different people talk about, but I want to show you in this video, kind of dive in a little bit deeper and kind of expose you to everything what every real estate agent sees here in Southwest Florida. So you will see direct information straight from MLS. That way it's gonna go to your eyes and go to your home, whatever you're watching me from. Uh, so let's dive in this video. Don't You don't wanna miss this video out. You don't wanna miss out on this information because this information is very, very, very important for you starting 2024 and understanding the market, what's going on in Fort Myers area, what's going on in cities around here. So do not go anywhere. Watch this video to the end and let me know what you think. All right, let's dive in. Before I let you in on all the secrets, let me introduce myself. If you're new to this channel, my name is Ali Petro. I'm here, your local real estate agent in Southwest Florida. So if you have any questions, comment below shoot me a DM, get an account, and we'd be more than happy to answer any questions that you have, uh, answer anything that, that you heart desire in regards to real estate, uh, and even now share my opinion about living here in Southwest Florida. As you know, I live here and I love it. All right, let's dive in and let me show you inside information on the market, what's happening in the market here in Southwest Florida, what's happening with the homes, what's happening with inventory, let's see what's, how many homes are sold, what's out there, it's, you can imagine. So are you guys ready? Uh, comment below where you're watching this video from because I would like to connect with you and let know where people or my followers are watching me from. It can be, will help me kind of navigate and give you more information that you'll be more suitable for you that we that way it's I'm not just producing content that's gonna waste time and because I don't want to waste my time I don't want to waste your time because your time is so important so anyway uh, let's quit wasting time let's dive into this video let me show you what's going on in the market you guys ready let's go I'm gonna share my screen with you so that way you see that way it's not only me talking about the market update but you see yourself personally all right as you see my name is Alec you see where I am located right now in Lehigh and it is 53, it is kind of, it's gonna be, it feels like 51. It's been cold guys, we're kind of enjoying it. Um, well, I don't know what time you watch this video, but it's kind of, right now it's January 2nd, my time, as I'm recording this video. Uh, hopefully you guys will get this video pretty, pretty fast, um, but it's cold and I love it. All right, guys, uh, this is a database of, of any, we'll say agent, that's what they see, you know, I'll, I'll do a video later as well, the difference between um, MLS, real estate agent uh, information, and the Zillow. That way you guys can see it because we get more detail, we get to see more stuff than a Zillow that we can offer to you. Um, so, anyway, we'll click on MLS, we'll get into it. So, now we are, you can see it, right? You can see what's going on in the new listings uh, 882 and then sold 648. Uh, and you got top of that, you got all the listings being expired. What's happening? I mean, how many spending? Listen, check it out. So new listing, there's 882 homes that went on the market, 646 homes got sold. So there is homes getting sold. Not much got rented. Why? Because there's not enough rent homes. Uh, 119 terminated, um, 716 expired. That's a lot expired right there. Uh, and 158 back on the market, guys. Uh, can you guys, and that's, of course, that's my listings right now. But uh, that's, I want you guys to kind of show it to you. I'll, I'll dive in more deeper for you guys so that you guys will see it more. But that's what's really happening. This is the area that I go pretty much weekly to see what's happening, how uh, many places got withdrawn and stuff like that. And that's why it's very important information to know if you are thinking to buy or sell a home because this, this graphic is gonna tell you what's really happening. Uh, and as you know, how many people are moving to Florida, kind of let it slow down a little bit, but there's still many people are moving here, uh, definitely. So let me go <clears throat> dive in a little bit deeper, showing more statistics and more dif different areas as well. All right, guys, so this is where I'm gonna show you guys. As you see, where the median sale price is gonna be in Fort Myers area. We can change different neighborhoods, right? Uh, different cities here as well. This is gonna be for single family residents, as you can see. Uh, and this Fort Myers, many days in the market, if they priced it right, that's why uh, 
the house price right, it still gets sold pretty fast. And here it says 30 days. So if you see homes that aren't in the market for a while, uh, this that means they're overpriced. Uh, well, also the percentage of guy was high and that kind of reduced it a lot of activity on the market. Uh, again, look at the new listings. It's only 404 new listings. New, I mean, active inventory is 1260 was, uh, you know, median sold price is about 255 per square foot. Um, you know, deals close is 208 deals close. And that is in November and December, so waiting for the kind of data to come out and show to us more in details because it gives us very accurate information. You know, in this comparison, same month prior year, uh, that'll be in 2022, uh, you can see drop down, uh, well, that was more more of it. So uh, that's 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 pretty important information, guys, for you to know if you're buying home and for Myers. Uh, we can change the keep coral. <coughs> Let's check it out. Let's check it out the four miles so we can see what a skip coral actually is. Is median sale price is 391. It's kind of pretty cheap, I would say. Probably not a little home because sold in the water or more, uh, you know, like a south, uh, southwest, uh, southeast keep coral. Um, those homes are pretty expensive. Uh, you have some homes that are kind of expensive when you go northwest of Cape. Um, but that's pretty much it. Again, you see 751, uh, right? 751 homes, and there's 343 homes closed. Uh, so you can see there is more activities happening going on. Um, let's go check it out. I know you guys will be like, oh, I don't want to hear about Lehigh, but uh, I'm telling you guys, Lehigh, it's if we did keep Coral 2000, you know, back in the 2008, 2007, and, 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 and Lehigh today. It's the same thing. It's it's it's, it's going off. So if you can see, me sale price three forty four. So it's not not behind Cape Coral. Um, two hundred seventy nine homes sold. Uh, in hundred. I mean, new listings. Sorry, two hundred seventy nine new listings. Hundred forty one homes sold. Uh, and you have median sold price two fifteen. So like a forty bucks cheaper than for Myers, right? So it's pretty crazy. As well, you can see me sale price. This is gonna be all. Here in South Florida, um, but I'm talking about not whole South Florida, but it's the majority of it is going to be your um, Lee County, Clark County, Henry County. Um, this is going to be the statistics for those homes. Uh, is, is you can see current week ending 12 30, 2023. The average sale price of homes is 403. Uh, they kind of average it off uh, through the year. You can see here. Uh, so it was a 6.3, 2023 was 450, it was higher. You can see the price kind of, you know, dropped and then went right back up, it's going back up. And it's not as high as here, but it's going back up, guys, that's for sure. Um, and again, this is, again, market insights, uh, kind of gives you all the breakdowns so for December 2023. Um, you know, you can see by quarter, it drops down by year. You can see we are, um, we are high. Oh, no, we're down. We are down, but two, two point one percent, guys. So kind of this kind of information breaks down, gives you all the details. Um, I kind of like to use. I kind of like using this right here. Kind of gives you more details of each city. Um, let me know which city you guys want more information. You can also uh, shoot me an email. I can record videos for you specifically where I talk about specific cities and give you market analysis. What's happening in the city? What's happening with the home sale price? How many days in the market, you know, for the house to stay on there? Um, and you know, what's the, what's what's the basically median sold square foot price? It kind of gives you average what your home is worth. I know Zillow Realtor does kind of they'll give you all these evaluations of your home, and they say it's going to cost X amount of dollars, and, and sometimes it's high, sometimes it's low. So, but this is pretty, 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 pretty accurate for you guys. Uh, so anyway, that's what's been happening in the market. But we know also they're talking about, I talked to Atlanta today, they're talking about cutting the percentage 10 times in this year, 2024. Um, it's going to be crazy. It's going to be crazy, guys. Uh, I'm telling you guys, take advantage of, if you're looking to buy, take advantage of buy downs right now. Do one point buy down and, and also you can do, if you don't know what that is, just come below. Uh, buy down and I, I will reach out to you and tell you uh, 
you know, I'll record a video for you specifically, or give you a link to other videos where I go and talk about what that is. Uh, kind of give you a better understanding what you can afford. Uh, it's very important. And then on top of that, right now, even though interest rate is high, it's 6.7, you still can find a house that you're gonna like. And I watch my other videos where I talk about uh, you know how crazy it was during the, the low percentage and how crazy it was to buy a house, right? It just you go look at the house and if you don't submit an offer the nights it's gonna be gone. Uh, and right now you still can go find a home. You still can go shop around week, two weeks. Um, some if they're underpriced you can see it's 35 days so definitely if something good in a good price range, right? And uh, if it's in this price range home um, it's gonna be gone pretty quick, so you definitely don't want to waste your time with that part. But you can refinance later, uh, and at one point it could be anything you know, anything between, uh, for example, for that price. Uh, I can tell you exactly right now for that price, it's probably anything between 100, 100, 140, 100, uh, 180 bucks less mortgage payments. That's, that's a lot. It's a lot of Starbucks coffee. I'm joking. Yeah. Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Let me know if it was helpful. Let me know if uh, this interesting. If it's interesting for you and i want to do this every month do one video a month just specifically update you guys in the market tell you guys exactly what's going on here in lee county um counties around us what's happening uh, also i can go you know in um, a little bit north as well because i do have access to the mls as well i'm a realtor in that uh, stellar mls it's same thing uh, you know sarasota area uh, venice and uh, other cities up north so anyway guys thank you so much for watching thank you for staying to the end of this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you find this video is helpful to you uh, hit the bell button so you can notified when my next video is coming out and also also share these videos with the friends that you know that you know of that are moving to southwest florida and want to know more information about it also uh, shoot me a message Give me a calendar, give me a call. I'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you have. If you want to build, invest, anything that has to do with real estate, I would love to be able to help you out. I'd love to answer any questions that you got. Anyways, happy new year, and I'll see you in my next video. All right, God bless.